Good morning, guys. Ah, there's a sun up there. And a woodpecker over there. Ah, let's do the time. I haven't got much battery on my phone. It's 7.27. And it's Wednesday, my day with Alfie. How wonderful. And uh, I'm out with my girlies at Wayne Body Wood. Um, I didn't do a video yesterday. Uh, I put up the one from the day before because uh, I thought to myself, well, if we, Mustafa and I drank the water from the stream and I thought the best thing that I can do is uh, not upload the video for 24 hours so that people can see we're actually, you know, had no adverse effects on us whatsoever. Yes. Isn't it amazing how these leaves are still here? <coughs> yeah. Beautiful. And uh, that water, you see, is actually being filtered through all of this. It's amazing. Uh, it's such a beautiful day. It's, it's almost like I don't want to speak. We're still close to the main road. And of course, it's a work day. Uh, so everybody's off doing their thing to get to work on time. Um, and I think... Um, I don't want to focus on negative things. Um, wow, hear that noise? <laughs> Sounds like a motorbike from the 1950s. Um, yeah, I think I... I'm going to put all of my energy, my focus, intention and direction into the things that I can do to make my world and my being um, as beneficial, happy and healthy as I can. Um, <coughs> excuse me. Uh, which way? This way, Ebs. Ebby? Ebby says, I want to go this way. All right, get your ball, honey. We'll follow Ebby. Her tail is still wagging, which is always a good sign. Bring your ball, honey. Um, the one thing I will say, it has been so cold. Uh, bitterly, bitterly cold. And um, I was taking videos of the snow at the end of November. So we have had like this four months of uh, snow, really. It thaws out and uh, then it again comes and it is bitterly cold. I mean, my feet are actually freezing today very very cold in this uh, uh on this earth um but it's the cold that breaks down all of these leaves and uh, takes them back to source and uh they just become part of the uh continuous cycle of of earth existence i suppose um but I, I'm doing things now. I mean, th there's people who um, who don't agree with uh, the OPPT, the One People's P Public Trust. There's people that do. I've I've given my stance on it. Um, so I'm not going to talk about that anymore for today, because. Uh, these debates about you're right, I'm wrong, it's true, it's false, whatever. Um, at this stage, I don't think anybody really knows. Um, we have been deceived for so long that it's almost like we will accept little lies 
against big ones, you know? I know it's not completely true, but at least it's not as bad as that. And I am aware of my own ego, my own personality. And um, I could very well be kind of latching on to something uh, because it's less than, at this stage, the existing system. I, I don't believe that, but I am saying it is a possibility. Um, and everything I'm seeing about OPPT, the I document, uh, oh, well, that is just wonderful, absolutely wonderful. Um, but there'll be others who will say I is in the middle of lie and whatever um, and I have to say that when I did watch that guy's videos um, Arthur for Life now Arthur for Life seems like uh, if, well they seem like really really nice people you know they, they just want a good life like the rest of us um, but he stands or he says like uh, God that is ice Galactic Federation of Light, where are you? Come on, come on. And then he'll say in another video, God, God, come on. Um, and that kind of made me think, well, God is within. Why are you shouting without uh, to, to speak to the God that is within? But, uh, you know, maybe there isn't a God within. Maybe I don't know. Because apparently it all comes down to knowing. Right, my feet are so cold now, I have to put my boots back on. Um, a crow, it's not a crow, what is that? Strange. Uh, you can't believe how cold it is here, it just looks absolutely beautiful, doesn't it? Uh, but it's freezing. So I'm going to put my boots back on. And... Uh, then I'll do another little video. Uh, sorry about these breaks, but in this weather, you do have to look after your feet. And I can tell by the colour they're going anyway, they are exceptionally cold. And, um, you know, barefoot walking is about building up your ability to, to walk in all kinds of different weathers and uh, textures, surfaces. And... Um, you know, if you injure yourself or... Well, you need to think, these feet have been covered. Mine, mine guys, you know, have been covered for, for 50... Even if I say there's been two years with holidays, walking on beaches, doing the barefoot walking I did as a child, stuff like that. They have probably been covered up for 52 years. Um, so this is gently, gently... You know, it's not about, uh, it's no competition. It's not about, oh, here am I and I can do it for like uh, 45 minutes running on glass or something. You know, it, it's about connecting with the earth and feeling good about it and looking after your feet and recognising that um, you need to take care of your feet. So I'm going to stop right here. A very beautiful stop place to stop look at the sun and uh, for now from honey Abby her ball and my freezing cold feet it's goodbye keep looking up guys you never know what's up there and uh, remember to enjoy life live it oh let's go and stand on the moss moss is actually beautiful um when you start oh the warmth when you stand on moss I don't know what it is about moss and I'm sure that we are going to find out about this incredible stuff at some point. When you stand on, on moss, you feel the heat. It's lovely. Right, so, um, I'll see you all in a moment. I do believe it's snowing again now. Oh, my word. Hey-ho. Bye. Ooh.